how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me. So today we are going to go ahead and talk about two products that were sent to me from the body shop and they are these self-adjusting drops. There's lightning and darkening. So if you guys are interested in knowing more on the self drops, then go ahead and keep watching. Okay, so the self adjusting drops, what are they? What do they do? I'm sure a majority of you guys already know about some of these products of what they can do for you. But um, for some of you guys that might not know too much about them, the lightning drops help neutralize the yellowness the shade a foundation for you so for me i do have a couple of foundations that are in a medium shade that do end up being a little more darker on me and i would more or less probably wear them in the summertime when maybe i get some color to my skin and get maybe a tan going on so this is going to help for me to use my foundations that maybe I might want to use during the winter time. And so I like that idea. Then we have the darkening one, which um, helps you know, uh, if you have a foundation that's too light and you want to darken it up a little bit. So it does help darken, but it also keeps the natural depth um, for you. So it, you know, if you want to go ahead and make it a little more darker. Um, I did read on I don't even know why or where. I had a little paper. Can I find it? No. I always do that to myself. It's like I put stuff places and then I like lose them. But I'm pretty sure that it mentioned that you can use this if you want to um, to mix in with a foundation and make a foundation a little more darker and kind of use it as contouring, like um, you know, like a cream contouring. Uh, so you can do that if you'd like to. One drop of this is a half a shade so it will just go up a half a shade more lighter or half a shade more darker and you know obviously if you want a whole shade you do the two drops so one drop is basically a half a shade um these are twenty dollars a piece which i know um it might sound a little bit steep for some people um at first when i did see it i thought the same thing you know i thought ooh, you know um but honestly, when you really think of the whole picture of it all and how long these are going to last you, I mean, like I said, you only need like maybe one drop, if anything. Um, this is 15 milliliters, so it's going to last a really long time. I know for other companies, they do have these self-adjusting drops. Um, Cover FX makes some. And I was ready to jump on the bandwagon. Um, I do believe I know what shade I would probably get if I did. Um, but it can be overwhelming, especially for a person that doesn't really know or is too familiar um, maybe with their foundation color or anything like that. You know, it can be overwhelming for somebody. So I think this would be great for, you know, for especially that person, um, just for anybody in general, really, because, I mean, how simple is it just one to lighten up your foundation if you have a couple foundations that need lightened up? Or if you are a makeup artist, these definitely, makeup artists, definitely, definitely will come in handy for you because, you know, you can adjust all your different kind of foundations that you have to the right shade for your client. So I think that's great. So we're gonna go ahead and play around with these. I'm gonna go ahead and show you this one here and how I lightened up my foundation, what I did. And I've been using my Laura Geller Skin Elements Foundation. Um, this one here I got in shade medium. Now I'm starting to get used to and familiar with what shades to pick for my skin. I didn't used to. I used to have a struggle myself sometimes. I would be like, I mean, I would feel overwhelmed, but I'm getting more familiar with things now and feeling more comfortable to a degree. But I did get medium. So there you can see it says shade medium. And I love this foundation. This was actually my top five high-end foundations, but you know, um, it is just a little, a little bit too dark. Right there it is. I mean, it's not extremely, but to get it to what I would want. So I put a little dab of my foundation on here 
it says to shake this up before you use. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna take one drop and let it, there we go. Cause I don't wanna make it too light. You'll see what I mean. So there it is in there in that little well hole there that it kind of made for me. So I'm gonna mix this up. See how it's like becoming a better color for me? You see that? What a difference. So now it is to the shade that's going to work great for me. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and dab this along on my skin. Yeah, see, this is like one of my favorite foundations from Laura Geller that I've tried. And it works perfect for my shade. And you can see the coverage already on this side compared to this side here. You know, so we're gonna go ahead, get a little bit more so I can do the other side. And again, put the one drop on. Like I said, I feel like I'm a science, you know, kind of person now. Like I'm in, I'm like in a science lab, <clears throat> mixing up my own, my own goodies. Now, the one thing I haven't noticed, and I have used this several times, I haven't noticed any breakdown either. That was another concern I had that was it going to break down my foundation. I have only used it with the Laura Geller one, but I honestly don't have too many foundations that are too, uh, too dark on me. Um, now, you could probably also play around with other products like your concealers and things like that if you wanted to. Um, you could probably do that. I know Kathy, Kathy A did, she got these drops, these self-adjusting drops. I know she did a video, video can't talk. I, she did a video also and showed a lot of different demonstrations of what she um, had used her drops for. So I'm going to put a link down to her below, Kathy A. If you are not subscribed to Kathy A already, go and check her out. And um, she gives a lot of great information um, in the products that she does a review on. She also goes in depth with some companies and talks about some companies. Um, it's, it's pretty cool. She does like a, a biography kind of a thing too. So I, I like those. Those are pretty cool. And, um, so yeah, she, she, she shared some of her little tips as well. So I'm going to put a link to her channel below, but there you go. I did put it all over on my face. Um, I only do one layer of foundation. I don't want to like look like cakey lady or anything. <laughs> I, I, I don't want to do that. So, but I, which I love the coverage that this foundation already gave me, but now with this, it's helped so much more. Also the body shop, I believe is cruelty free from what I, I know. So that's a plus also for those who 
you know, obviously if that's important to you, um, they are cruelty free, but yes, I would give this a thumbs up. I would definitely say, give them a try, check them out. Um, it will help. Like if you're somebody that does have a foundation, that's kind of a little bit too dark and you want to lighten it up, I would say, you know, obviously get the lightning one and this will be great for you too, to help adjust if your shade is a little bit too light, you know, um, cause for some of our darker skin beauties, like they can look a little more ashy if they don't quite get the right shade of foundation. I mean, I'm sure that's their struggle. My struggle for me being fair complected totally is like looking maybe like an Oompa Loompa for one, maybe on some foundations or anything like that that's too dark. So I really like these. I was really happy with them. I've been using them the last couple times and especially with my Skin Elements foundation that I love a lot from Laura Geller. It works great. So, all right, thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate that. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That would help me out so much. It would make me happy. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, you can go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. Join me each week. And as always, beauties, please remember, please, please remember to just be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. So until the next time, you all take care. I will see you then. I love y'all. Bye-bye.